guys, Sveti Munoz here. Today let's go to Pilates and Bar Basics. Very simple, very short, easy, but always think quality first. It's not how many times you do it, it's how you do it. And also listen to your body and only do as many as you can. Okay? So, let's go, yes? Okay guys, let's start by adjusting our form first. Okay, so you're gonna lift up your chest. You're gonna lift up your chest. You're gonna take your shoulders down and back. You're gonna squeeze your stomach very, very tight. Squeeze this part right here, squeeze. Take a deep breath. Now, moving on to our buttocks. Squeeze it tight. I always say, uh, if you take the wedding ring off your finger and place between your butt cheeks and squeeze it tight. So the whole class, you cannot lose your ring. So one more time. You breathe. You take your shoulders down and back. You lift up your chest. You're engaging your core muscles. You're squeezing your buttocks. And on top of that, you're going to take your knees and bring them as high as you can towards your hips and engage your thigh muscles, okay? So that's it. So one more time. Inhale. Relaxing your face, shoulders, chest, stomach, glutes, and the thighs. So go ahead and squeeze all of this together. Your feet can still be touching or keep distance apart if it's easier for you. So squeeze everything possible. Squeeze it super tight. Lifting chest. So right here, you are very strong and solid. Yet right here, you're relaxing your face. If it's in yoga, you would call it a mountain pose because you're strong as a mountain, but very powerful and nothing can move you, right? Nothing will come and punch you in the face. <laughs> so there you are. Inhale through your nose. Ah, exhale, mouth and your nose. One more time. So squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. And exercise number one is your stomach. So we just want to contract, 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 contract. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. Rest and maybe repeat one more time. Every time you squeeze, you exhale. Or let's say every time you exhale, you squeeze. It doesn't have to be loud, but that's this is I'm just showing it to you. Okay, so exhale, contract. Core, bottom, it doesn't matter. Every time you exercise, you exhale and you contract. Moving on, let's go to do the same thing, but on our hips, and our buttocks. There you are. Again, uh, inhale and relax. Shoulders, chest, stomach tight, legs are strong. And let's focus on the bottom, on the bottom. Squeeze, squeeze. One, two, fu, 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 seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and twenty. Release, nice. Release, release, release. Now, uh, let's go to ballet first position or Pilates stance, whatever you want to call it, guys. Both are right, both are correct, just different name for different classes. So I prefer, I prefer first position. It's easy, it's easy for everybody. So heels together. Now only turn out your feet as far as you feel comfortable. It's not gonna hurt your hips or your knees, okay? You gotta feel comfortable. Quality first, yeah, yes? Lift up your chest. Take a deep breath. 
relax your face, strong body, shoulders down and back, strong core, strong glutes. Have a feeling you're about to go, not down the, down the hill, but um, your hips are moving forward. Most of us have archy back, right? Most of us will put the belly forward. But here you go, squeeze and take the hips forward, okay? So, here you are, grow a little bit taller like somebody came, grab your hair and lifting you up high, okay? So, think tall, grow taller and let's focus on that. Inhale, exhale and grow, grow, grow taller. Again, inhale, exhale. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Inhale. Ah, grow taller, but the shoulders stay down. Inhale. Exhale. One more time. Inhale. Exhale. Great. We'll go to the plie and the squeeze. So simple again. First position. Then there is a difference in a squat and a plie. Squat when you keep your feet parallel to each other and you take your hips back, okay? I actually have a chair here. If you need to use the chair, use it to support you. So when you do squat, you take the hips back. When you do a plie, you take the tailbone down. So if you would have a wall behind you, you would scratch against the wall. See, I do the plie here right now, body weight on my heels, wiggle your toes to know you do it right. Stomach tight, use your thighs to protect your knees, right? Some people say they have knee pains, knee pain in the bar classes because they do it wrong. You got to think about your thighs and when you are in the plie, you engage your thigh muscles and engage and it will take pressure from your knees. I know I have knee problems, so I know my body and I, I really need to focus on that. So, squeezing, wiggle your toes, go ahead, wiggle your toes. You know you, you know you do it right, you know your body weight is on your heels. Now, the lower back will be touching that wall, even the imaginary wall, you know. So the lower back touching the wall, you're lifting up your chest so the upper body is touching the wall. Like a bear in the winter, you know? Not in the winter, in the summer. They scratch the tree. They sleep in the winter, right? So, here's your plie. Strong thighs. You're squeezing your glutes. You're squeezing your stomach. You lift your chest. You inhale and you relax your face. Let's bring arms in front of us just to make it a little harder. So, your legs are working. See, your knees and your toes. They have to look the same way, same direction, in order to protect your knees and not to hurt your knees. So there we are, a plie. Again, you can hold on to something if you need to. So a plie. Now look at my hips. See, I take the tailbone down between the heels. That's important. And let's pulse. Down, up, and squeeze the bottom even more. Let's go down, slide against the wall or tree. Stand up and squeeze the bottom. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, and a three. One, two, four. Inhale, exhale. One, two, three. Now this is great for the ankles as well because we're stretching our muscles. You know when you do bar classes or Pilates, bar mostly, you can wear high heels after with no problem. Your, your legs, your calf muscles won't be sore. Ah, that's a cool thing. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Now just stay here. We're going to bend our knees. Here you are. Now, if you do it right, if you hold this position correct, if you actually squeeze your muscles, engage your muscles, you can even get lower, but keep your heels on the ground still. Your muscles, your thighs will be already shaking. 
Mine are, I have not done this for a while, so I already feel it. So there we go, let's, now, super easy. Get down, stay down, lift your chest, inhale, relax your face, and let's pulse. One, two. Now, if your knees uh, have pain, you might feel it right now. But, in order to avoid the pain, you focus on the thighs. If it's way too much, please stop and take a break, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten more. A one, let's slow down, and a three, and a four, and a five, and a six, and seven, and eight, and nine, nine and a ten. Four. Nice, let it go, let it go, let it go. Shake, 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 shake. Massage, massage, massage. Couple times, you can hit, 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 hit. Massage, massage, massage. Even touch the knees, bring the attention to the knees. Massage, massage, massage. Huh. And if you have a chair, it makes it even easier. You put your foot on the chair and you massage, massage, massage. Super awesome, right? So easy. Nice, you can do this, you can do these massages, you can do every day. Nice, 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 nice. Well, here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, moving on. Let's go ahead and step out to the second position. First position, legs together. Second position is when you uh, keep your body weight on one foot, on one leg, Extend your other one out to the side and press your heel down. There we go, second position. If your joints hurt or something, you can make it maybe smaller or maybe go wider. For the big plies, we can go wider. So again, we're going to do a little plie. Yeah? Right, remember, this is your squat. And the plie yeah, when the tailbone go, goes right between the heels. Okay, that's important. So, we can use a chair again or not. You can use the wall, you can use, um, um, you know, your closet, you can use anything you can possibly touch to support you. The only thing when you do bar classes or um, pilates, don't rely on that chair or, you know, whatever. Uh, because, you know, you start leaning towards the, the chair and uh, you forget what you do with your body. And that takes away the workout, the exercise from you. So here we are in the second position. Again, only turn out your feet as far as you know it's not going to hurt. Let's go to the plie and let's listen to the body first. Let's learn it first. Here we are, a plie. First thing first, inhale. Exhale, relaxing the face, yes. Lift your chest. Shoulders down and back, stomach super tight. Now, tailbone, see your hips, we go straight down between the heels, yes? Now, use your thighs to protect your knees. Use your core to protect your back. Again, wiggle your toes. Like this, you know your body weight is on your heels. So, let's pulse right here. We're going to pulse. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Keep going. So remember I said quality first, right? Because you can go, oh, yeah, 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 and you are done. No, don't do that. Do it for you. Do it right. Love your body. You, you spend so much time right now just to watch this video and try to do it, this exercise. Don't waste your time. If you're going to be here, don't, don't even bother, you know, because you're not going to change yourself. If you're already here, it's a huge step. So do it right. Yeah, it's better to do one time and squeeze and shake and burn and feel. But um, at least you will see the progress, okay? So no dancing, but work super hard, okay? Love, treat yourself super well. So let's go to the plea, yeah, one more time. Uh, nose, inhale, face, shoulders, stomach, hips, <laughs> legs, and next exercise for you is tap your toes, tap your feet, tap, tap, 
Now, when you do that, really focus on your buttocks right here. Squeeze it. Every time you lift your toes and place it down, you're focusing on your bottom. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. 10 and 9 and 8, 7 and a 6 and a 5 and a 4. You can go slower. Yes, 2 and a 1 and a rest. Let's step back from the chair and stretch, 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 stretch. Round your back, maybe step closer, flatten your back, but do not arch your back. That's really bad for your back. Just flatten your back and you take the tailbone one way and you take the hands the opposite way and this is your stretch. Oh yeah. Nice. Great. And one more, uh, focusing on the bottom again. So, uh, inhale through your nose. <sighs> Relax your face. I know when we start focusing on the muscles and we're going so deep, we forget. And what happens with the face, when we contract and uh, when we focus on something, it goes, oh, it's so hard, right? So relax your face. We're still too young to destroy this part right here. <laughs> still yeah, too young to get too stressful in the classes. So inhale, relax your face, chest up, shoulders away from the ears, keeping them back. Stomach tight and attention to your bottom. We're going to go to the back corner. So slide your leg to the back corner. See the leg you're standing on right now? Go ahead and bend that knee, okay? Again, now watch knees and toes, gotta look the same direction. If it's easier for you to go to the corner, do it. But watch your knee and your toes, make sure they go same direction. It's safe, it's safe for your body. No, no you will not have any pain. So there we are, here we go. The right leg goes to the corner. And let's bring it, your knee in, turn it in and bend your knee, right? Flex your foot and now with that heel, push to that corner. And when you push that corner, you squeeze that bottom. That's the key, not how many you can do, not how many times you can hit that corner, but how much you can squeeze the muscles on your buttocks. So inhale, bend your knee, exhale, push and squeeze. Let's do, let's count one, two, three. One is in, two is to push, and three is to squeeze. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Foot, foot. Inhale, foot. Inhale, foot. Foot. One more time. Foot. And let's do it on the other side. So you can hold on to something or not. Let's bring body weight on the other leg this time. Bend your knee, lift your chest. <sighs> Relax your face. Hold on to something or not, one more time. Bring your knee in. <sighs> squeeze your glutes, it's important, squeeze. Knee goes inside on one. You push back with your heel two, and you squeeze even more on three. One, two, four. inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, no, oh, sorry, one, two, three, one, two, squeeze, one, two, three, one, two, let's do two more, one, two, three, one, two, squeeze, four. And release, release, release. Again, you can use the chair. I found it really, really helping me today. <laughs> and uh, massage, 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 massage. Massage, massage, massage. And I like number four stretch for, for this. So number four, uh, call it number four, um, just because it looks like number four. So we're gonna inhale. And exhale, taking hips back. Now, like we talked about the squat, right? 
so it looks like your squat so you're taking the he uh, tailbone away from you it's gonna feel nice right here right right here Whew, stomach tight in this position do not round your back don't arch your back so it's not too painful for you stomach tight inhale exhale and switch your legs again number four inhale exhale sit down sit back it's gonna feel nice right here guys it might not be for everybody but it is possible okay inhale exhale and thank you for watching guys hey super simple right now go ahead and eat something give your body good protein and good carbs the protein will feed your muscle and carbs will give you energy not just right now but when you wake up tomorrow you will feel much better and will be in a better mood so always eat after exercises always 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 do subscribe to my channel if you hit that little bell right the next uh, next to the word subscribe you will be able to see all my new videos as soon as i post them so thank you for watching it was sveti mulias i'm here always for you have a good day. Bye.